assess our students, plus guidance from the Autism Initiative Consultants, we've been able to document significant and meaningful gains in our students' language, communication, and social behaviors. Jimmy, ready? Okay. What's this? Good the VB map enables us to see where each student has deficits so we can develop individualized instruction for that student. Touch the caterpillar! <gasps> Good touching the caterpillar. Since implementing these teaching strategies and suggestions from our consultants, our students have made incredible progress. Uh, oh, excellent! Close the door. So three years ago, Cameron was having a lot of aggressive behaviors, hitting others, hitting himself. That has dramatically decreased. He has that occasionally now, but not nearly like before. Gets along much better with others. Socially, as far as peers go, that's improving as well. He used to just keep to himself and not really engage with other kids at all. Or if they tried to play with him, he would just move away, do his own thing. And now he will play with other kids some. He used to not make eye contact with people. Um, and he didn't have really any sounds that meant much of anything. He would make sounds, but they weren't actual words or, you know, intended words. Phone? Hammer? Peanut butter? TV? Crayons? Fan? Pizza? Potato chips? Pencil, no. letters, Brush. paintbrush, and he's very good at understanding others too. He understands everything I tell him, everything his teacher tells him. Um, so that the communication has been amazing. Cut, cut. What is this? Ba. Mm -hmm. What is this? Bitten. Smith. What is this? House. What is this? Papa. Chair. What is this? Go. Go. Good job. Lisa. I have an eight-year-old daughter, Mia, who attends one of the autistic support classrooms here in Reed Elementary. Um, Mia is very familiar with the VB approach. When she was diagnosed at two years of age, we had a VB um, in-home program for her. Um, she's actually transferred from a private school placement into the Reed Elementary, um, the VB classroom. One of the reasons we were most comfortable with her doing so is knowing that they were using the verbal behavior method and that all the great Patan folks were here um, in her classroom supporting that. I think that Mia really liked school. It was her first year um, at Reed last year. Um, she really liked it, but this year she loves school. Um, she's waiting at the door for the bus to pick her up. Mia's good. Mia's good. good. Mia, what are you doing this summer? Summer mommy. And where's mommy taking you? Mommy taking you to the park. Good. Where else is mommy taking you? Mommy taking you to the park. Mm -hmm. And where else? Hershey Park and... Swimming. She's made enough language-based gains, I think, from last year to this year that she's far more social this year. She's talking about um, the kids in her classroom by name this year. That's a big difference from last year. Um, she's also really excited on the days that the Reed classroom goes on their community-based instruction or their trips out into the community. She's uh, it's a really great big component of this classroom for Mia. She loves the trips, she loves being out in the community, she loves the experiences, and she talks about those for weeks to come, 
requesting to go back to those places and being really excited about the days that she can. I think it also helps her work a little harder during the school day knowing that she's going to be able to experience that trip either later in the day or later in the week. One of the greatest changes to see in Mia this year is her use of the word friends. She most definitely understands what a friend is. She's made friends this year and it's a huge joy in her life and it's a joy in our life as her parents.